Well, that could have gone better, but it could have gone worse too, I guess. The fatalist or defeatist way of looking at it, I don't know. But uh, it went the way it went, and uh, there's room for growth. But um, it's like <sighs> I sensed uh, there was some expectation of how things were supposed to have gone yesterday, and no, it didn't happen, um, and it was a disappointment. Um, like I was supposed to have known this and I was supposed to have reacted this way and it was something else was supposed to happen but it didn't um, and for me what happened was uh, you know I did the little 10 minute piece uh, yesterday about uh, what was that the um, uh, about 15 hours ago and, uh, you know, I was in a certain mindset. Then I sat down and uh, ready to go and start. And then I looked at it and I was like, I'd seen it wrong. You know, at least I thought I'd seen it a certain way. You know, a picture, you know, a little pictogram. I thought I saw a candlelight and a couple leaves. But when I looked at it again, now that I was settled, it was just leaves, a couple leaves. And so that one character threw me off. You know, because I thought I saw a little candle when I was thinking a flame and then leaves. And But instead it was just a few leaves. And so the one leaf just, I don't know, caught me and I thought it, you know, I wanted to see that and, you know, I don't know. Because it would have tied into an old conversation, uh, a conversation from a while ago and and uh, that made sense. So then it, it was just leaves, and I was like, oh, well, she's not really saying anything. She's not really asking for anything. She's just uh, acknowledging what I wrote a couple days ago. So it doesn't mean anything. So she's not looking for conversation. She's just acknowledging it. And, uh, you know, so I quickly con persuaded myself, convinced myself to, you know, like, well, yeah, because I use that as a way to end conversations or to, you know, say, like, I, you know, I hear you, I understand. You know, it's like, uh, or at least I, I hear you. I don't know if I always understand, because most of the time I probably don't. You know, can only work on it. Um, and that's the word I was thinking about. I'm out of calibration, you know, the whole syncopation thing. It's like, I, it's been too long. I, whatever original connection, that's gone. Um, that is never coming back. That original uh, thought pattern, um, you know, it's not a bad thing. Because um, the new one, if there is a new one, um, the new traces, um, the new origin point, um, you know, can start off again and uh, be stronger um, on the foundation of uh, the previous. You know, that exists. It's still there. Um, but it's not for continuation. That just came to an end. And so this is, this is new. And so it has its own beginning. Um, you know, and so it's like, yeah, I'm following the thread. And, you know, see where it goes. It's like I'm not adverse to, uh, you know, continuing. So, and I know, you know, it's like, I don't know what she knows. And she doesn't know what I know. So, I got the impression that I'd left an impression that uh, it seems like maybe... And I'm guessing, from her perspective, that uh, I didn't really do so much um, in January. Maybe all I did was just, I just sat around waiting. Or I don't know exactly what the impression is or what image construction she has. But she you know, seemed to think it was very sad 
to uh, be waiting um, for something that might never happen. And uh, it's like, well, I wasn't. Like, I mean, it was running in the background. It was just kind of there, and I was just, you know, you know, hoping. But, uh, you know, but then as soon as it rolled over, and I had that, you know, and then it didn't, it's like, oh. And then I started immediately um, making those videos and, like, trying to figure things out and... <sighs> trying to be nice to myself, trying to forgive myself, um, understand myself, where my feelings were going, where my thoughts were going, um, appreciating um, what I'd learned, and, you know, I don't know. But I was already getting ready. I was preparing for goodbyes. You know, writing goodbyes, speaking goodbyes. And, um, you know, and it's like I haven't put those away. They're just, you know, I've, they've been practiced enough um, where it's like, yeah, I might, I might still need them. So I'm just saying it's how, it, you know, it's, and it's not because I want to, you know, it's like uh, uh, conservation, preservation. Um, you know, am I being a bad influence? I might be being a bad influence. But I don't have the determination um, for that. I don't get to make the call. It's like... I cannot be told um, that however it is I feel is wrong or however it is I think is wrong. I might be wrong, and my feelings might not be doing me any good, but I'm not wrong to think it. I'm not wrong to feel it. So, and I don't need to def defend myself or explain myself. I may choose to, though, you know, because I want somebody to understand. But, uh, and I'll probably be you know, this is me waking up. You know, I had a nice long nap. So then I'll probably go back out and type something. You know, because my impression that these will not get seen is standing. So what I know is that, yeah. So... What was my other thought? Dang it. Oh. Must not have been that good. Oh, right. So what I ended up doing yesterday, after the last video, which is going to private, by the way, so it won't even be visible. I'm going to do the whole parentheses two. So it, it kind of hints that there was a one, but it's not there. But it will be there, it just won't show. Because... It's too revealing, and I reveal too much. It's nothing bad. So, yeah, um... After I quickly went back and then just saw that it wasn't, I wasn't needed for anything, um, I was immediately was like, well, she acknowledged that she read my thing, my treatise, my uh, confession. And, uh, but only even acknowledged that, well, no, it was only later I found that out. Um, so I, did, I, I just decided that that's what was meant. And uh, did nothing. And it's like, well, there was nothing else to go on at the time. So it's like, well, I guess I'll uh, do what I normally do on a Sunday. Have a cup of coffee, maybe get something to eat, take a nap. Because it is every other Sunday, and we have our house.
accountability meeting, you know, sometimes every other week, depending on the person that runs it, if she feels like having one, if it suits her agenda or her uh, time schedule, and she forgets to. She doesn't mean anything by it, she's just... Anyway. So we actually did have it at 6 o'clock. So by the time I was like sitting down from being back from work, it was like 3.30. And I had to fit that nap in to reset myself. And I didn't even get a really good nap at all. But then wake up, went to a 6 o'clock accountability meeting. And, uh, and then, you know, that was only took like 20 minutes and then go back up to the apartment and then get ready to go to a 7 o'clock meeting at Albanil because again like, mm, just regular Sunday and I got back from that and I went to the grocery store and uh, got some supplies because of the snow because I didn't do that when I was at work because uh, I was so busy there was just so many people and by the end of my shift I just wanted to leave so that's what I did and I was like, I, if I decide to, I'll go back later and get whatever I think I want for survival mode. So we're going to get 8 to 10 inches of snow or something. It's going right now. And so that's what I did. And I saw the aftermath of uh, Valentine's Day. I, oh my gosh, I said it. But it's not even that day. It's the 15th now. The Ides of February. So, a lot of, it was just, the store was, it wasn't as, actually it wasn't as bad as what I kind of thought, but anyway, so I got what I wanted and, and made it back with five minutes to spare before nine o'clock, and I'm going to be talking with uh, my mom back in West Virginia. So, and right in those couple minutes... Um, when I'm just getting pre mentally prepared and getting ready to be destroyed emotionally and uh, talk to the way I get talked to. Um, then I see a text with a paragraph um, that uh, gives me some information. Ask me a question or two. I don't remember what it said. But it got me thinking, got me, um, got my interest. And uh, but then I, I couldn't do anything with it because I had my call. And I thought about, you know, it's like, I, will it? By this point, it's like whatever was supposed to have maybe have happened didn't that didn't happen. It's like, uh, so I just went ahead and. Had my call, and it was pretty terrible. Yeah, she's. Yeah, so I'm not even going to talk about it. And then by like quarter to ten, this time I, you know, sent something back to you know, acknowledge, and you know, like Valentine's, or it's already the fifteenth over there, and it's just a couple hours more over here, and so it's like. It's like, I don't even acknowledge the holiday normally. You know, I never have. So it's like, to me, it's just another day. You know, so it might have been Halloween for all I know. You know, it was a very nice Halloween on the 14th of February. Happy Halloween. I don't know why they had all the different, you know, colors and, you know, stuff that they had out for it. You know, I thought Halloween was a little bit darker, you know, more skeletons and stuff. I don't know. It was a weird Halloween. Everybody seemed to get along just fine, and you know, I didn't get a chance to, you know, really talk because I was just exhausted by the time I got to, you know, you know, because we hadn't talked in six weeks. Yeah, not even, you know, exchanging little tiniest. 
not even, and that wasn't even anything. So it's like, I'm out of calibration. And, um, you know, and I, I never really knew her in the first place. Um, you know, I said a sense. So, and I can tell that I'm not being, you know, I know all these conversations that I've been having um, with myself, talking to myself, communicating with myself, letting myself know where I'm at, what I'm doing, how I'm feeling, what I'm thinking about what I'm feeling, what I'm feeling about what I'm thinking about what I'm feeling, and seeing if I'm okay with stuff. And so it's like, I know these conversations. I've had them. Um, I don't remember them. That's why they're here. Um, but I give myself, I give myself credit for having had them. Like I have a sense of having worked through different uh, problems or, you know, thoughts that I don't, you know. So I've already arrived at certain permutations, conclusions, working, working theories, working hypotheses, yet to be explored, but charted, charted mysteries. But even them, uh, even they uh, are only just even the bare beginnings. It's like a to be touched on later. You just know they exist. And it's like, there's just too much. There's too much to, to ask. There's too many questions. And it's just, everything's proceeded with the knowledge that one thing at a time. And I can't, I don't get to know everything. I'll never get to know everything. Um, but hopefully I just get to know enough to keep, you know, wanting to know more, you know, that curiosity. My curiosity is not um, sati sa satiated, sated, sated. So, I keep investigating, I guess, yeah. So, as long as it's tolerated, yeah. So, yeah, so a lot of the way I do things is, uh, yeah, I can see how that perspective, yeah, it does seem sad. You know, it could, it probably does look very, very sad. A lot of my life, to an outsider's view, is probably really, 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 really sad. And um, borderline pathetic, uh, depressed, um, you know, all that kind of fun stuff. But you know what I call it? I call it normal. This is my life. And, you know, I'm used to it. You know, all the stuff that I have going on and all the stuff that I don't have going on, I don't even notice. It's normal to me. And, and other people seem to think it's strange because they're not the ones that, you know, I've lived my life up to this point. So this makes sense. Everything that leads, leads up to right now it makes sense to me, but for anybody else, it's like, how how does a person get to where I am, believing the things I believe, you know, operating the way I operate? Um, well, how much time do you have? But no one wants to take the time, and it's like, I don't have the energy for it anyway. So, you know, live and let live. A lot of the, I don't know how people deal with all the stuff that they deal with either. And, but I don't worry about it. That's their life. That's theirs to deal with. And if they're okay with it, then I don't need to know. Until Unless they make it something that I have to need to know about it. But most of the time, I'm fine with just not knowing. That's why I generally don't ask people how they are. Just out and about. Like, oh, hi, how are you? No, I don't. Because they might talk to me. And they'll tell me how they are and what's going on. And it's like, you know, how much time do I have? And it's like, I'm going to have to remember this now? And have that responsibility for knowing these things and remember? And then I'll have to check on them later, another time? And 
It's like, remember what they talked about the time before, and it's like, there's just too much, and there's too many people, and I can't keep track of it. And it's very overwhelming and frustrating, and I, I just don't want to deal with it, so I don't. And then when, and I, I want to be treated um, how I treat others, you know? So people ask me how I am, and I'm annoyed a lot of times because they're asking me while I'm busy doing something else that I know how to do. And when they ask me how I am, then I have to stop doing what it, I know how to do and think about a question. It's like, how am I? And I, most of the time, I don't know. I don't. I like questions that I know the answers to that I don't have to think about. You know. You know when it's at work, just you know at, at work when I have like time to, you know, actually think. You know, I'm okay. But just when I'm at work and or at you know like meetings and stuff, because most of the time people even at meetings they. I don't know. It seems like almost like a lot of people uh, are, they want to ask you how you are so they can, you know, undermine you sometimes or give you support. It's like, I don't know. Ugh. So, yeah, so the conversation last night, it. forced, rushed. It was not natural. I mean, I, I think... There were parts of it I recognized. But it just didn't, it didn't have the rhythm and flow um, this seemed distracted. I think there might have been some um, there. I don't know. I think on her end she was doing other things as well, you know, which is okay with me. I take my time to you know, think about how to say things. So, and if somebody's just waiting on me, which is exactly the case, then I get nervous and I don't. I don't. I, so it's like I like to take my time. So, so I'm glad she multitasks. You know, give attention to other things while I'm deliberating my thoughts and because uh, it takes time to like draw those thoughts out the tendrils of memories and patterns and so anyway this is my little video on the 15th of February, 2021. I'm going to go ahead and upload the other one. I'm going to upload it as the 15th and then have it marked as private so you won't even see it. It won't be seen. And then this one will be two. So there will be like a hint that there's another one, but it won't be there. Because whatever I said there, um, that was all the... And I won't even watch it either. So, you know, I just remember the thoughts that I was thinking at the time. It was with a, a knowledge. It was with an understanding that I considered it wrong. It's like I, did, I figured that, no, I, I've, I've got it wrong. So then I shifted and went to the other one. So, and I don't think that was right either. So I just don't think I was right about, I don't, I wasn't right about yesterday. I didn't have anything wrong, but I wasn't right. You know, it's like, there's just, but I can't get down on myself, you know. How am I supposed to know? I don't think. 
I mean, maybe I'm supposed to know, but I don't. Uh oh. For whatever that means. But I'm not gonna let it I'm not gonna worry about it. I'm not gonna let myself be worried about it. I'm just gonna keep doing what I'm doing. Because I, I like what I'm doing. Could I be doing something different? Yeah. Could I be doing more of it? Maybe. I really don't know what my limitations are. Um, you know, whatever I set my mind to do, and I can do it. You know, I haven't... Uh, but it's like, and there's some things like, if I'm not asked, then I don't know. And the same goes for me. You know, if I ask people, you know, if I don't tell people things, that they won't know. And sometimes I offer information that people rather they wouldn't know. They wouldn't want to know. So that's where the uncomfortable things come from. Because I'm just telling people things. Because I I want them to know how I feel. Because I don't want um, anything left unsaid. Like should something happen, and this is the last conversation we ever have, um, that I didn't get a chance to, or I didn't. So even if I don't directly, you know, tell something, or uh, I want there to be, I want to have some sort of sense of uh, resolution. Uh, but yeah. So anyway, these aren't happy. No. I, like, this is figuring things out. So, I have no idea what it's like on their end. You know, how they deal with things, how they talk about things. Or, you know, I think they just write. Um, I could be totally wrong. I probably am. But apparently, this is how I do things. Um, and for now, I don't know if I'll always do this. Or even how much longer. This might be the last one of these I ever do, for all I know. But for now, all I know is I'm going to, uh, you know, I've got some coffee warming up from yesterday. Um, and I'm going to get the first video that I didn't upload yesterday uploading. And then uh, setting it to uh, private so it can't be seen ever and then I'll work on uploading this one and then let's let it go because whenever I once I'm done writing it or saying it it's like I stop thinking about it I don't have to remember all that stuff um, once I've written it or said it so it's like people ask me like, it, like they were talking about people might ask me about stuff later and it's like I have to think about it, it's like, because I don't just automatically know. So, anyway, it's getting long, this is going to take a while to upload, so I'm going to go probably outside and look at the snow, and maybe take some photos. It's still dark out, of course, it's not even 6 a.m. yet, the sun's not going to be up for another hour or so. Hmm. So that was my uh, February 14th. It wasn't a, it was just a regular day. It was a, you know, yeah, I've already said it. So, anyway, I'm going to go do whatever it is I'm going to have done today or get a start on it. Mm-hmm.